it just underlines that belief in the camp that this is doable. Yeah, absolutely. It'd be the Wigan way, wouldn't it? Um, I always doing things the hard way, but um, I think we're at that point now. We've kind of felt all the pressure there is to feel and faced everyone there is to face. And now, really, the, there is no pressure. We'll just give it everything we got and see where it see where we end up. And a solid clean sheet. You can only do your job, can't you? you must be delighted with the performance and again that uh, shutout. Yeah, that's it. Um, I mean, we've not we've not scored. You know. I can't think of us scoring more than two goals too often no. um, in a game. So, you know, that's going to be important in the running as well to uh, you know, clean sheet. We are, we're never going to take at least a point. Yeah. And going into this weekend's game, I mean, it doesn't get much tougher than Sheffield United away, does it? No mm. expectation, but I guess a, a free hit for you guys. You'll go there with no pressure. That's it. And sometimes it kind of, uh, you know, it does kind of play in our our favour. I think some some of our best performances have been against the you know, the teams at the top. We know we're going to be up up against it for periods of the game. But uh, yeah, as you say, a bit of a free hit, and everyone's you know, just got to do the best and see what we can get. Yeah, do you enjoy playing at Easter? Two games in three days. Traditionally, it's a big big moment in the calendar. Yeah, I mean, it's kind of the same as you know a Saturday and Tuesday yeah. in terms of. Uh, Time between games, but uh, but oh yeah, it's, we're used to you know, playing over Christmas and uh, holidays throughout the year. So so that'll be good. Hopefully, it'll be good, good uh, crowds uh, around the country with it being a uh, bank holiday. Yeah. And you look at the league table; it's now five to safety. You're just within touching distance, aren't you? A couple of good results, and hopefully get the right side of that line. That's it. Yeah, I think we've probably got to win over half of our games to to have a. A sniff. Um, I think they've got a game in hand on us, but yeah, you never know. All we can do is, you know, kind of get that siege mentality again about us, us against everyone, and let's see where we get. Whatever's happened this season, it's always seemed like you've, you have had that unity in the dressing room. The gaffer and various other players have always spoken about that, the the belief and the the togetherness in there. That must be a, a good thing to have at this stage of the season. Absolutely, yeah, and I think um, you know, kind of the adversities that we've gone through as a squad as well uh, this year and last year. Um, I think that obviously just brings everyone closer. Um, those shared experiences, um, and yeah, that's going to be kind of a big part in the in the running, really. It's never dull at this club. I mean, last year you had the highest of highs, and this year it's been <laughs> lows. But uh, just keep going, eh? Exactly, yeah. That's all we can do. I think um, I think everyone's prepared to give absolutely everything, and uh, and yeah, I think we've just got to go for it now. I think you've seen a couple of games where we're drawing in the past, we might have dropped off a little bit and been a bit more conservative, whereas it's now draws draws are now good to us. And just a word on that save right at the death. Looked like it was creeping in, but I guess that's why you're in goal, isn't it? You've got to get that concentration for 95, 96 minutes sometimes. That's it, yeah. That's that's part of it. That concentration side where you you're in and out of games, um, and yeah, that's that's what it's all about.